Hello, thank you for joining me at Five and Makeover. Today, we are going to take the struggle out of eyeshadow, okay? I am asked so many times, how do I put on eyeshadow? So we're gonna use palette six and do a quick, easy daytime look. Are you ready? Always put eye primer on first, okay? I already put it on because, you know, you gotta leave it on about a minute to dry and I don't think you guys wanna sit here watching me fan myself off. Eye primer, number one vital thing. It's really gonna make your colors pop. The second very important thing are brushes. Invest in a good brush. Fluffy crease brush is an absolute must. And we are going to start there. So using Calm, and I'm gonna try and use as little brushes as I can. So Unique is highly pigmented. You just want to put a little bit on. This is going to be our base color, Calm. And what, what it does is just evens out your eye, your eye tone. So when we apply our next color, it's, it's going to have an even base. And less is more. It is highly Renee recommended. <coughs> Please put on a little and build if needed because you don't want to waste product and you don't want to end up looking like a circus freak by slabbing too much on. I mean, this stuff is highly pigmented, okay? What shall we do next? So, still using the fluffy crease brush. We are going to get... We are going to get impressive. And, you know, you could tap it off or, you know, if you have brush cleaner. But I just turned my brush over. And make sure you kind of tap off. You want to kind of do like, okay, remember, remember uh, greater than, less than? You want to do that in the corner of your eyes, like little Pac-Mans, and go about midway. Okay? About midway. And I started on this eye. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so little Pac-Mans. And remember... If it, like, if you have fallout or it gets anywhere that it's not supposed to be, we blend. We blend last. So don't stress and fret over it looking all perfect and, like, straight out the gate. Now, if you want to add a little something more, you could add a matte in there. I personally like to contrast matte with shimmer or metallic and pooey on those old wives tales that women over 40 should not wear glitter. Um, you know what? It only will enhance the wrinkles that you have in your eyes if you put too much on. Less is more. I'm just kind of going right under, you know, little windshield wiper. Bloop, 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 bloop. And I said this was a daytime look. This could kind of be used for either or. Ha, ha, ha. What you think so far? See, it's looking pretty, huh? Now, if you want to get lofty, and this is our um, liner shader brush. Let's get lofty. You know, we'll kind of meet them up together where we did our little greater than, less than on our eyes. And do a little bloop for a little inner eye strobing. See that? Inner eye strobing is great because it makes your eyes look bigger and brighter. Let's see. Let's, let's get a couple little bloops going. Now, delightful. This is the most beautiful color ever. It is very, very metallic-y. And it's a little bit different in texture. Look at that. Now, if you want to make your eyes look a little bit bigger and brighter, just... Get delightful right under that brow line. Look at that. Isn't it pretty? So pretty. Now for liner and brows, we can use this palette. So I'm thinking let's get some blazing brows. See, that's all you do. If you don't have brows, let me know and I will give you brow options because this video is all about easy eye look now brows are super duper important okay i'm 45 my brows are balding thanks to a steam lash serum that i put on my 
eyes every single night. I also stick it on my brows and my brows have started to get a little bit bigger and bushier. So who wants to walk around with balding brows? I sure as heck don't. You sure as heck don't. When you do your brows, it also makes you look younger and frames your face. Brows are the archways to our, I mean, not, oh, see, no, brows actually are the focal point of our faces and you saw how quick that was. Just follow your natural brow. Just follow it. And again, if you don't have brows, let me know. And when we like friend up, I will totally help you with that. Okay. This palette is also great as a liner. So using the other side of the liner shader brush, we will get audacious. See, look. Now you could wet your brush for a really like more amped liner look. Just squirt a little bit of rose water on there. See, look, I'll show you guys the difference. And it really makes that color super pop. Super pop, super pop. And also when you wet your liner, um, you have a little bit more control. And when you are using it as a liner, control is always a good thing, right? If you really want to make your eyes look whiter and brighter for me, I, this, okay. I'm a mom bee in the morning. I have kids. To demombify your eyes, make them look brighter, whiter, bigger, make you look more alert. And when you look in the mirror, instead of going, holy crap, you're going to go, oh, look, you can't tell I was up half the night with my kids. White liner, makeup bag must have. White liner. Oh my goodness, we are almost done. Delightful. Look at the, oh, look at that baby. Doesn't that look so pretty? It doubled as a highlighter. Can add it to the center. I'm all sparkly, honey. You want a sparkle kiss? Look at that, you guys. Multi-use, versatile palette for all of your eye needs. Let's see, seven minutes later. Now, normally it... You know, to do my eyes, you know, it takes under five minutes. I mean, I'm five in makeover for a reason, right? But, you know, I'm yammering and trying to help you guys. Now, to finalize your looks, walk around rocking that confidence all day, Epic Mascara. Okay, to get lash-tastic, lash-tastically long lashes, you're going to want to curl them. Epic is a one-step curly mascara. Yes, it is. However... I like when my lashes and brows battle each other and kind of fight for space. Let's see. Oops. I am the queen of oops. Let me grab my lash comb. Now you see how I uh, got a little bloop right there. Lash comb. This is great for your brows. And your lashes. See, look at that. You guys, one coat. I'm trying to do this in my phone, but I don't want to wear an eye patch again. Hazard of my job, my childhood dream job, where I play with makeup all day and spread confidence and help women look and feel beautiful. Yeah, one time I poked myself in the eye. <laughs> Oops. Look at that. See, one coat. And then... Just swipe it up with your lash comb, you know, just to kind of separate. And how many of you guys do your bottom lashes? Bottom lashes, you know, that's personal preference. And I like to do my bottom lashes because I'm all about making my eyes look bigger, brighter, whiter, and getting rid of the mombi look. Let's see. So... There you have it. Easy peasy. Any questions? Be my friend. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I am on Facebook. If you would like exclusive content and would like to be in my VIP beauties group, friend me on Facebook and just let me know. Say, oh, I saw one of your crazy videos and I will pop you in VIP beauties. Today was brought to you by Palette 6. Oh, see, I kind of screwed that up. Today was brought to you by Eyes and the Number 6. Okay, now I screwed that up too.
Today we played with palette six. I hope you guys learned a couple of like quickie hacks and tips and beauty tricks. So Renee with five and makeover. I love you all. Let's match your palette.